Mm -hmm. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good whatever it is, wherever you are out there. Antagonize the back here with you. And welcome back to Lord of the Rings Online Mondays. My wall's being weird. Oh well. <laughs> It'll deal with it. It's fine. Absolutely fine. So, <laughs> we didn't get to Moria last time, unfortunately. Um, today, though, we're getting there. One way or another, we are going to get there. <laughs> so, let's uh, let's just dive right into everything here. i got some free stuff to open. And i got a lot of crap in my inventory, too. That I need to decide on, because I'm <laughs> I'll decide on that later, and then I never decide on it. So, let's see. These are my two weapons that are 67 and 60. I picked up 69. Okay, you'll replace you. And 67... Uh, number 69. Hmm. You know what? Those seem like good weapons. Alright! Um, anything better that I have two-handed? 99 damage. Hmm. That's a lovely sword. <laughs> uh, vitality and might? Not bad either. You know what? We're going to be getting our uh, epic weapon in here just a moment, so let's do a little selling. And then we're taking the mithril coin over to, uh... What do you want of me? The legendary Why program. do you trouble... Hold on one second. There we go. <laughs> Turned down my audio a little bit. A little bit. Repair everything there. And start selling things. Uh, yep. Goodbye. Farewell. Um... No. Uh, that's the defender. Uh, these axes. Any of these. Peace bringer. We don't like peace. We love war. Uh, that is Randirum. I want to keep Randirum. And I want to keep a Lumley Earth axe. So goodbye. Farewell. I hate to see you go. Goodbye. 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 Uh, I collected so much crap. Ah. <laughs> uh, Bozy's necklace, though. I think I might put that on. So we're probably going to keep that. Get rid of Ida's axe. That's crappy. Scrimshaw's... No. No thank you, good sir! No thank you. Uh, where was Bozy's necklace? Is that it? That is a token of brute. Uh, there's Bozy. Uh, I don't care about that anymore. Oh, black steel keys. Do I buy a key? I'll do that off stream. <laughs> Alright! We're moving on along. Singing our song. Talk to Dithilion. Off to Dithilion. We are getting into Moria. Today is the day. No, no messing around. My heart cannot sing today. Um... Bring the weapon to the Forge Master to be identified. Um. Okay. Who's the Forge Master? <laughs> Out of the way. I thought the Forge Master was up here. Oh, where do I. Uh. Is that the Forges of Rivendell right next to him? Uh, ah, Snarf! Your service. The champion's great sword of the third age. Identify, please. The Raven Ray. Or oh, I'm sorry. It's that fucking guy. And free up the hello from Puma. Guy, how you doing today? Welcome everyone to Lord of the Rings Online Mondays. And my coffee is still liquid lava hot. <laughs> so how's everyone doing today? Hope everyone's having a most fantastic Monday. Hopefully you uh, also had it off. And thank you, Guy. Welcome aboard and welcome back, my friend. Always great to see you. Uh, plus one to brutal strike damage. Yeah, let's go with that. 
Okay. And equip my new weapon. Beautiful. And Kuma will return. Kuma will return after these matches. Uh, where's my... Ah, there we go. Let's see how fancy it is. I want to see how fancy it is. Cross those in the way. Um, uh, cross that. Take that off now. Yeah, it's it's all right. It's okay. <laughs> Put the crossbow back on. All right, the Therian. My hearts cannot sing today. Slot a setting relic. And good day to me. Good day to you. Good day, brother. And you're for customization. All right. Um. He's wanting me to do a lot of things here. Uh, slot of center. How the hell am I doing? Order the no, no, no. Uh, this is one of my other lights I had. Uh, <laughs> oh, I did order that. Yes. Lights are <laughs> the Raven with the Raid, the Conspiracy. Welcome aboard, everyone, from the Conspiracy. Hope you had fun in Pokemon Village Land. I I don't know the name of the town. I feel so bad. <laughs> so thank you for the raid, Raven! Raven Vulcans, everyone. Actually, I gotta give out some shoutouts because I forgot about that. That plug-in guy. There we go. Get that out there and a shout out to Raven Vulcans. Thank you very much, my friends. Welcome aboard for Lord of the Rings Online Mondays. We are uh, currently on the train to Moria. One way or another, we are getting there. <laughs> so I need to slot a relic. You're here to mod. I thought you were here to party. Hmm. I don't know if I like that. <laughs> Okay, so how- I forgot- I completely forgot how to slot an item. Is it the Forge Master? Snar, talk to me! Talk to me, Snar. Oh. Alright. Oh, so, it's been so long since I played around with my, uh, legendary items. There we go! Uh, let's put in... He wants me to slot a relic. Okay. Power, morale, might. Yep. There we go. I don't have any gems. Don't have any rooms. Don't have anything crafted. Beautiful. Am I done? Can I go? Can My I go kill a giant today. snake, octopus creature now? Uh, choose one. Ooh. Drown Kingdom. <laughs> That's what I'll be tomorrow. Excellent. We Excellent. Stay a moment and learn of my troubles. Unlimited power. Yes, yes, yes. They gain experience as I do. Achieve the 10th level to advance with my new weapon. Oh. <laughs> Come on, can't I just go kill the giant creature now? That's what I want to do in life. I, I, no, I do not want that. No, there we go. I want to kill the giant snake creature. Ooh. Uh, skills. Let's get down to... Turn back to a region. So I hope everyone's having an oh, absolute fantastic one today. Uh, I know I am. I got to uh, have the day off. And Vela, welcome aboard. She is ready for battle. <laughs> Vela is ready for battle. Not sure my fan to face me. Not doing anyone any good. All right. So let's get the tracking. Vela is the Ultra VIP. That is 100%, my friend. So, now I guess we just gotta go sleep. Shit with our sword. Level it up. Uh, it's getting late and I got an exam soon, so I'll be hopping off in a bit. Thank you. Thank you. Much always appreciated. Always glad to have you here. Uh, so I'm just gonna kill things for a little bit here, trying to level up this weapon. The early levels to leveling up your weapon, uh, legendary weapons, is fairly easy. So, I'm not too worried about getting it up. Don't quote me. But but also, I'm not. Anyway, moving along, singing a song. We got a song in our heart tonight. I just gotta beat the animals to death for a while. There we go. See? Leveled up. 
It has gained its first level already. Fantastic. And I think I can turn on the track again. Yeah. There we go. We'll track there. It has a uh, rank points you got to spend. Uh, when you, so you can level up your weapon as you wish. So we're just going to go smush things until we get level... Look, we're already at three. Just got to get level ten. Gonna kill bugs and humans alike. Uh, is that an evil tree? It is an evil tree. I hope you have all the glorious sleep, Zuma. Take that, Mother Nature! <laughs> and we are up to level 5 with the sword already. Beautiful. Like I said, it was going to be really quick to level this thing up. And I wanted to do it down here. Hopefully I don't have to go back to not really looking forward to the travel back to Rivendell. Not looking for that. Hello! You look like a Pokemon. It kind of does! I mean, it looks like Bulbasaur had, like, a... Like an accident in, like, a FEV from Fallout or something. <laughs> um, so, yeah, what lights I went with, I... Since I have limited space, I don't have room to do, like, stand-up lights. Uh, like a lot of people do. Um, I'm very limited. Uh, it's a smaller size apartment that I live in, and my desk space is crowded, because I have my work computer uh, right there. Uh, yeah, right next to me there. So I got like a ring light uh, that's movable, that so I can move around, but it can clip to my desk. Uh, it goes up and over, and it can be like right in front of the camera. Uh, it's right in front of me and just shine right at me. Right now I'm just using a uh, little GE uh, touch light that I got for $11. So. The batteries on that thing. I replaced the batteries every stream. Let's just put it that way. So thanks to Vela, um, I was able to make that purchase uh, last night. And uh, yeah, the new lights should arrive by Wednesday if everything uh, stays correctly. And my new microphone shall be arriving on Tuesday if everything goes correctly. Thanks. To, uh, so thank you, big huge thank you to Vela and Deuce Fire for making that possible. And, Increasing the quality of the stream. So that means my, my next thing is probably going to be a, uh, a stream deck so I can do fancy things. Like make my head even bigger. So that's probably the next thing that I'm going to be looking into. Um, I know an Elgato uh, capture card is on the list somewhere. Alright. Is there no one here? Hello? I need to murder you. I need three more levels on the stupid sword. Indeed for upgrades. And we'll also probably be having Assassin's Creed on the stream at some point. So that'll be fun. Come here. It came with the came with the microphone, so that should be coming in soon. But yeah, I was taking a look at the stream deck, um... Oh, is that someone farting? Good job, I'm gonna give you a cheer. Huzzah! <laughs> oh my. And now hopefully everything won't start disappearing once I enter a certain area and get back by ghosts again. As happened in the last, last stream. That would not be fun. Give me a pure experience. Oh, these rockworms are great experience. Uh, I need more rockworms. Ah, you'll do. Bow the, bow the side. <laughs> See, I have, to, I have to tie in the last, the, what you were playing, Raven, to uh, to my stream to make people feel more comfortable in at home. So, I just killed Bulbasaur. How does that make you feel? And I just wasted a potion too. So, silly of me. But yeah, so, uh, probably the stream deck. I don't know, the mini seems like it's gonna be fine, which is six keys on the stream deck. Um, um, well, I mean, I do have an Amazon wish list. Um, I just don't tie it to my, to my stream, uh, to be honest with you. Um, 
Because I also use it, uh, Lady Ant and I use uh, a wish list for uh, Christmas shopping, birthday shopping. Our birthdays are literally, literally, uh, uh, like, one after another. <laughs> uh, hers is the day before mine. So we kind of use those for those, and uh, we put non, non-gaming stuff on this game, so... I like to keep it up. I like to keep it separated. <laughs> Um, I'll look into it, Vela. I mean, it shouldn't be too big of a deal. I doubt anyone wants to get me a, uh, food processor. Because I've been watching all the cooking shows and all the good cooks have food processors, and I need one now. <laughs> uh, non gaming stuff that exists? I know, tell me about it. What money I don't spend on gaming, I spend on improvements in my kitchen appliances. I don't have the money for it, but I was looking at a $4,000 refrigerator. It's one of those ones where you can uh, check your, on your phone, and you can see inside your refrigerator to see what you need. <laughs> Lady Ant was like, um, we don't need that. <laughs> you know what, I was like, fair enough, fair enough, you're absolutely right, we don't. That was cool. I want to order food from a fri my fridge window. <laughs> but yeah, actually, my 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 gaming component list is not that large anymore, uh, thanks to uh, the generous donations uh, that I received. Uh, the capture card is. <laughs> uh, we need seats that we do need seats and couches that can they? Well, they already have seats that do that. Um. The Elgato capture cards on there. The, uh, like cheap green screens on there, um, and the stream deck. Those are like the three things that are on my, uh, for gaming wise, on my list right now. Amazon does sell coffee. They 100% do. I have actually purchased coffee through them before. Uh, through the Amazon Pantry, I believe it is. Come here, Rock. Oh, I'm one more level until I can get the stupid thing leveled up. Come on. So close. So close. Yeah, I'll, I'll think about uh, putting my wish list on there. It's, it's a good idea. It's, an, it's a very good idea. Yeah. Then I wouldn't have to be like, yeah, it's on there. Trust me. Um... But yeah, the new light will be arriving, like I said, both things will be arriving this week, so... Uh, hopefully by the time I do Hellblade, uh, on... Um... Thursday, the quality of the stream should be pretty well, uh... improved. Oh, there's also a new, uh, webcam on my wish list, too. This one's a, like, 780p. Uh, the one I have on there is, like, a 1080p. Uh, one. Just a clearer picture, I guess, would be what I was looking for on that. But that's real low on my list. I mean, the camera I have is absolutely one of them. You know, not, not all of us can look as uh, suave and handsome as uh, Raven and Doom, you know. Get, getting, them, getting them looks. Those milkshakes bringing them all to the yard. There we go, level 10. And I have to bring it to Wafi or Dehillion. You are pretty boys, my friend. Where's Wafi? Can Wafi be in a place that... Has... Wow. And I can't even fast travel to him. Uh, Wafi is in Thorns Hall. And it is... Damn it, now I gotta go to Rivendell. Uh, guy, you are... You are a... You are a sex symbol, my friend. And you are not going to convince me any any different. Not different at all. There we go. Legendary item is reforged. Blah, blah, blah. So I got 90 points I can dump some points into. Let's rank up the damage. Beautiful. Excuse me, tree. I'm trying to spend points here. Uh, all right, keep breaking up that damage. 99 damage. Oof. 
Uh, I'm gonna learn to eat and try my best to be creepy. Hey, I strive for that every day. <laughs> uh, am I going the right way? I'm off the road. I like it. Keep it up. <laughs> Raven with the words of encouragement? <laughs> uh, Moisey. Moisey. Okay. So we're going to go to Wingris. And hopefully there's a fast travel to... Or a... Uh, yeah, swift travel to uh, Rivendell. Because I do not want to have to go all the way to Thorns Hall. That would, that would be lame-o. Lamo Americano. But yeah, I was looking at a whole bunch of lighting setups, and yeah, I was, I was going through a whole bunch of things, actually. Uh, while I should have been watching other people's uh, streams, I was looking for new lighting. Um, and one moment, sorry. Oh, sorry about that. Got distracted, heard a beep. But it was just Raven. Uh, but yeah, so I was looking at different lighting sets. Everyone's like, get soft lighting, get soft box lighting, key lighting, and all that fun stuff. And I'm sitting there like, okay, I don't know where the this is. I can't find really anything besides the Elgato setup on uh, uh, Amazon. So uh, I'll be able to eat some good things possibly tomorrow, Wednesday. Uh, no mail be delivered today. Yeah. Yeah, that kind of stopped everything today. Um, I had to put in my rent payment uh, today, too. And, you know, the banks are closed, Legal unfortunately. Uh, Rivendell, Swift Travel. Beautiful. <laughs> I can get there. Shy Guy, I hope everything does work out uh, with you tomorrow or... Uh, uh, tomorrow, Wednesday, um, when everything comes in. I do, I do wish the best for you, my friend. Definitely. So everyone was like, you know, there's these uh, uh, stand-up lights. Uh, it's a huge stand-up lights. All I could find was, like, photography stuff. And it was really kind of, like, pissing me off, because I was like, all right, can you just label your things for streaming? <laughs> uh, finally, I was like, okay, I found one that, just with my limited space, I don't have room behind my monitor to put something up, because my second monitor is right above it. Uh, so I don't have much space for a light shining down. Uh, but this one, and you're going to laugh at me, um, and I don't care, but it's the best I could do uh, with the space I have. Uh, there was a camera with a gooseneck, uh, or I'm sorry, a camera, a light with a gooseneck. Uh, it's ten shades of dimmable. Uh, it has a gooseneck so it can be moved around. Uh, it's a ring light, so I can actually put it almost behind my camera, where... It'll arc around it and not be blocking uh, the camera from casting shadow. It's for makeup. Uh, that's one of the key features on it that it was for streaming makeup, because it also has like a phone holder. But, 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 I also thought of a secondary idea I could possibly use it for. Streaming cooking. When I, when I start doing, uh, if, if I start, which will be 2020 if I start doing it, but I can also use it to do my uh, my face streaming of cooking, of live cooking. So laugh all you want for it being a classified makeup ending. streaming uh, light. I think it's going to do a good multi-purpose. Feel free to laugh now. Will you lend me your ear? Uh, I won't bring it up. Lips are sealed. Lips are sealed, guy. By the way, I'm eating it after the stream. Uh, what about when you put my makeup on? That is very true. I am very pale, so I probably should, uh, I should probably put some makeup on. <laughs> Bring the weapon to the Forge Master to be forged. Uh, you are the Forge Master. I am Master. at your service. Reforge my sword. Okay, guys, I can name my weapons. What? You know what? Because, Vela, you gave that awesome donation. My sword's name is Vela. I do not want to refund my OP. Reforge. Legacy, I want... Force to strike cooldown, yeah? There we go! There we go. <laughs> Beautiful. So I now have a sword 
named Vela. It is my first legendary weapon on this character for the VIP in the channel. And the sorrows of the Eldar are never ending. For my new lighting. That should be right, Ethan. Uh, talk to Rathwald, which I think is back down. Yeah. So he's back down by the gate. I'm taking the quick way down. The absolute quick way. But yes, if you do want to, uh, if you want, uh, there is a uh, link on my Twitter. If you go back a couple posts, uh, you'll find it out uh, to uh, for a uh, GoFundMe if you feel like assisting. Uh, Assistant Shy Guy there. There's a link there that you can uh, take advantage of if you'd like. Uh, chapter 12, Forged Anew. Actually, Fallen Mori, is that what I want? Perhaps there is still hope. Which one do I need to do? I just want to, alright, let's just talk to you first. We will Finish reclaim that. the lost halls of Khazadum. There, Watcher in the Water. We will reclaim the lost halls of Khazadum. Yes, we will, my friend. Let's do it. I hope you know what you're doing, friend. <laughs> I hope I know what I'm doing, too. Dyer is the creature called the Watcher in the Water by the Dwarves, an ancient <coughs> evil called forth by the Dark Lord. Perhaps through the power of legend, a way can be seen past the terror? All right, Vela. It's you and I. We're going to take down the Watcher in the Water. Uh, the fall creature that watches from the water within the depths of the pool will feel the sharp bite of your weapon and be afraid. Dwarves have like a pirate voice to this. So i got to kind of do that. Stride forth and teach in a lesson which will be long and forgiven. Do this not just for the sake of Kazadu, but for the memory of Broid, taken by that fell creature. My nephew deserved a better fate than to die in that thing's grasp. When you have driven off or slain the creature, we will be unopposed and may walk into Moria unhindered. One of my dwarfs has gone ahead to scout for the beast. Look for him and be watchful. Yeah. You got it, Bozy. Let's go. Me and my cotton ball hat. We're good. Alright, who do I got here? Iron Guard. None of you are named. <laughs> May Doreen return soon to his halls. There are ripples in the water. Here we go. <laughs> I always like it when the dwarves get grabbed. They get, they get, they slam like an otter slam. <laughs> Time to die, tentacles. Feel the sting of Vela. Whoa! One down. Ooh, that sounds good too, Vela. That does sound definitely good. I almost made tea this morning, to be honest, for this, uh, this stream. Alright, cousin, where are you fear? Is that it? Oh, protect Broder. <laughs> Show yourself, monster! Alright, Broder. <sighs> tea is everything. Leave Broger alone! Eh. Broger's my dwarf! Leave him alone! Get your hands off her, you bee! I don't want to say the word. Uh... <laughs> Come back! My vengeance is not sated! Uh, hey, Broger. Good for you. What about you? Is that it? Was that literally it? Moria. Moria. Slot modes, hold on. If I'm going into Moria, I'm going in with a cup of coffee. Black tea. I love black tea. Black tea is my jam. Creamer.
and stir. You. All right. I had a dandelion tea, and that was actually pretty, pretty, it was pretty good. I liked it. All uh, right, chapter thirteen. Perhaps I get there is a still item. hope. Hello, item. I love items. Ooh, that's a. Oh, finally, I get to lose my crappy looking helmet. Survivor of the Watcher, that is the heavy armor helmet. Beautiful. Perhaps there is still hope. Bacon tea, is that a thing? Alright, there's a lot of tea chat going on, and I approve of it. Talk to. And so it was that the Iron Garrison passed the doors of Durin and entered the dark of Moria. But they were not the first to brave the mines, nor will they be the last. I do remember the Balrog being a little bigger, but, you know, eh, what's he gonna do? <laughs> he wasn't just the size of a door, but... That, we'll, we'll give the game a pass, right? Why, you fools? Oh my god. Everyone, we've done it. The door is open. Speak, friend, and enter. Level that up anymore. Um, don't have things to throw. I do. Uh, deflection, defense, block rating, evade rating. Let's go to here. We slot that relic. <sighs> A new title: Seeker of Deep Places. <laughs> it's my spot now. It is my. It is definitely my spot. Let's uh, first just make sure there's everything in here we collected. Take everything I need before it all expires. Dwarf shirt? I don't need a dwarf shirt. No one needs a dwarf shirt. We're gonna put on our brand new fancy helmet. Okay, that is so much better. That is so much better than my cotton head. <laughs> oh, I look like an open cans. <laughs> Um, I got the books for Christmas since I lost mine a long time ago during the move. Oh, I'm glad you got new copies. I'm very glad. I wish I would have known you, um, I wish I would have known around that same time. Uh, if you had, like, a P.O. box, I have an extra, like, two extra sets of the Lord of the Rings trilogy, and, uh, <laughs> I probably could have sent you a copy. <laughs> uh, I have a lot of them. <laughs> I also got a leather-bound uh, Hobbit for a uh, uh, Christmas year before. All right, and we're gonna we're going in the way we should. Hold on, how do I turn off? Hold on. I don't know, but we're going in. <laughs> we'll talk after the stream. <laughs> the books are really great, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Moria. Oh man, the the immensity of this place. Oh my god, I love it. I love it. Absolutely love it. Oh my god. Just being here, ah. <sighs> Immensity, high ceilings, all kinds of big college words. Doom, welcome aboard, welcome in, welcome to Moria. The day of the dwarves is coming. The day of the dwarves is coming, my, my, my fat little friend. It is here. It is here. And I actually turned on. Okay, turn that off now. 
Moria is in. Uh, choose one. I can't use much, so I guess I will take the champion's rune. <laughs> I kind of don't really have much of a choice. So the dwarves will prevail. Here we go. Talk to Brent Sharplight in Dolvin. You talk to Brent Mar in the Deep Descent. Okay, so Dolvin View is right over here. We're over here, probably underneath my face. We are under my face, and uh, we have to get over here that's not under my face. Uh, so, we could run it, but I want to go with the Goaty way. Friend. Are you lost? I did buy a new, <laughs> a new light for my makeup. Uh, Vela kindly donated uh, money to improve my lighting situation. Uh, yesterday, and I purchased a new light. I may as well just tell you the whole story now, dude. Everyone gather around for uh, Let's Embarrass Antagonizer Hour. <laughs> and uh, because I have limited room uh, around my desk, because I got my work computer to the other side with two monitors, I got my computer time, uh, gaming computer with two monitors, one above each other. I, and I have a light here, the mic here, uh, computer down there. And I don't have a lot of room, so I couldn't get a big stand up light where everyone else can, uh, has the room, uh, that I don't. So, I found a light, and, hey, that guy's impressed. Um, I found a light, and it clips onto my desk, so I can put it behind my, uh, behind my monitor. And it has a gooseneck where I can move it to where I need to. It's also for s the main feature, and even in its name, it was for streaming makeup to Twitch, YouTube, you know, what have you, whatever. Um... It was a it was a makeup camera. It even comes with like a little thing where you can put your phone into it, uh, and just use it wherever you need to. So, dual purpose though. While yes, it would be great for my makeup, as uh, Bale pointed out, uh, because I got to add some rosiness to these cheeks, a uh, little rouge, you know, so on and so forth. I can use it for cooking streams that I plan on doing next year. So. Multi-purpose, and I might use it for makeup. Who knows? Makeup stream? <laughs> I might. Who knows? What if I do, Raven? What you gonna do? Uh, by the way, we've been running on this goat for a very long time, and everywhere you see here is places you can go. Uh, this place is layered and huge. This place is a monster. All right, so uh, I can't get any of those quests. I need to pick up things you. Uh, let's rebind. There we go. The Let's shadow see. of Mordor will not long fill the halls of Khazadun. All right, so the dwarves have moved in, which is fantastic. Now I need to go to. I need to go to somewhere over there. And again, it's trying to find your way through this place sometimes is a pain in the booty. But it is beautiful. It is absolutely beautiful. And it activates my vertigo pretty, pretty, pretty heavily. I don't like that at all. <laughs> hey, cat girl, welcome aboard. Welcome into Lord of the Rings Online Mondays. How you feeling today, cat? Be feeling better today. So let's uh make our uh if you like playing all day, <laughs> questing through Moria takes about three days to get through it. Yeah. I mean it's probably gonna take us a bit more uh the, the time week, has but... come to drive forth the orcs from our kingdom. Uh where's this guy I gotta talk to? Is he down? Whee! There he is. It's been so so long since I've been here. Welcome to Casa Doom. Talk to Bozy in the Chamber of the Crossroads. Whoa, cross cross Perhaps soon we shall stand face to face with Lord Barley. Uh, I'm just gonna start grabbing quests as I go through. If we drive the orcs from Casa Doom, will it be Orcs enough? Many foul things dwell in the depths of the mountains. I fear the orcs will be the least of our troubles. Man, he's talking for a long time. 
Alright, so there's uh, supposedly ore uh, right around these, the camp here. I can pick, ah, there it is. There's some! So yeah, we're gonna be just, I'm gonna pick up as many quests as I can as we're making our way through here. Uh, this one is actually pretty close, so I'm just gonna grab whatever I can here. And I'm betting more down. Yep, there we go. There are more. And I have to go to... Where the hell is this up to next? Is it... Was it Endurance Way? Was it... Where's the Chamber of the Crossroads? I'm totally bent... Totally blanking on where that is. Um... 21st Hall... Oh, I'm lost. <laughs> uh, Alright. Let's just... Like, one thing at a time, right? One thing at a time... I'm gonna be like Charles Winchester of MASH. I do one thing, I do it very well, and then I move on. <laughs> uh, still getting the exact text, just like one minute and fine. Hmm. Well, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Kakuru. That is a bad feeling to have. So, you have all- you have all my energy and, uh, and, uh, compassion coming your way, so. It's all coming right through the right through the camera for you, all right? Take my energy. Six of eight. And reddish ore sample. Don't even know what it is. It's just reddish. There we go. Oh, hello. <laughs> hello, dog. I'm probably gonna kill you. Yeah, I'm just gonna kill you. I'm sorry, dog. You're probably a good doggo. Although you look like another Pokemon that just went through a radiation bath. Come on. Come on. Ow! There we go. Okay. What's he put on me? A root in 10 seconds. Which means I'm going to stop moving in three. Oh, it didn't even root me. How about that? Uh, bring the ore samples to snow. Well, I guess if I'm going this way, they're, they are literally right there. Uh, Vela killed the dog? She, yeah, technically Vela did kill the dog. Uh, is it even a dog? I mean, what is... What is even a dog? <laughs> uh, enemies of the... Uh, let's grab your quest first. Stay a moment. Goblin armor. We'll need your aid against the orcs of Moria. Uh, defeat goblins. At long last, right. we will drive the maggot folk from our holes. Ugh. The orcs of Moria have much to account for. All right. Cool. Um, I gotta kill goblins. All right. Let's go murder us some gobos. What? Ah, invisible goblin. Amoria Sneak. Put some pants on, sir. You're exposing your goblin dong. Goblin dong. You know. Uh, back out here. That's a cute doggo. I like that. I like that emote, Vela. That is one cute doggo. You're, you're coming in with all the animals, Vela. You're coming with rabbits and dogs. I love them all. Uh, let's see. It's, it's, it's coming from well, I mean, Star Puma. <laughs> exactly as Guy said. All right, Vela is a blood drinker. I could probably level my sword up too for more damage. Uh, where's my legendary weapon? Yeah, I could rank that up now. Boom. 101 damage, Vela. You are now the strongest weapon I carry. <laughs> Calm down! I think insanity has finally set in. Hi, Gothic. Come here. Come here. He is... He is 
flip it. <laughs> Jesus. All right, I get it. I get it. You're the Goblin King. Calm down. <laughs> Even in death. <laughs> oh. Somebody did take a sweet roll. Oh, get back here. All right, rude of me. Stop it. Stop running. <laughs> that is me without coffee. Uh, thankfully, I do not do morning streams. <laughs> goblin town. Living the goblin life. Nope. Jump back. <laughs> I don't know why they even bother running back after this. It's... Goblin art. Oh, hello. I woke you up, I'm sorry. And there's a- Oh, I got two. I got two distracted by goblin art. Some say to this day they can hear it. It's true, they can. Cut back here. <laughs> a little Moria sneak. I need two more armors from here. Hmm. So, the, uh... Okay, I'm guessing this is about the, uh, dwarves, uh, first the goblins, I'm guessing. How the goblins attacked, they were led by, uh, Mr. Triangle Face here. And, uh, they kind of set fire to, uh, the dwarves. And the dwarves ran away, panicking. Well, that's, uh... That is, uh, Moria for you, ladies and gentlemen. You, <laughs> you no longer need to watch. <laughs> that is the story of Moria. I'm drunk. There we go. And drunk in this game is no laughing matter. Alright, 9 and 9. Let's get out of here. Uh, which door did I go in? That... Doesn't seem like the right one. I think I went through this one here. New goblin, hello, friend. Friend goblin. He has like a spike on his back. And yes, you can go down there into that gaping mall down there. You see, no, that is another part of this map. Don't throw a bomb at me, don't throw a bomb at me. Or he threw a pumpkin at me, I think. Where did a goblin find a pumpkin at this time of day? Alright. Yep, you can just stay right there. No, I have no quarrel with you. Not a quarrel. It's clear to peace some, uh, peace some how society nowadays is being overtaken by a group of angry people. That's true. Armor in the Azog's folk have not yet fully repaid for their crimes against us. And I we will reclaim get... Kazadum for dying Ironfoot. Um, that's not a bad one-handed weapon. I guess I'll take that. Go after Smog if that's a thing. Um, I think by the time con uh, canonically, uh, Smog is dead. Um. <laughs> If I had to say, does he have more quests? For him? I think you can take part in. Uh, belongs to Doom. Yeah, folk. I think though you can do something in Dale. I just can't remember what you have to do. Uh, use the hidden passage. What hidden passage? Oh, that hidden passage. I'm gonna climb into this. Uh, go to Rivertown. Yeah, I haven't actually been to Rivertown. What am I doing here? Arm the trap. And lure puck lore. Okay, where's the trap? Okay, it's like right there, so... I'm guessing I gotta kill these guys. Yeah, I've never done the uh, Rivertown stuff. Unfortunately, like I said, all my friends kind of stopped playing the game at a certain point, so... Uh, I never really got like a good group uh, together to do stuff in. Do the cool like, endgame stuff with. 
and uh, events and things like that. Not that it, I don't even know if Rivertown is an ending, honestly, because I've never been there. Oh, yeah. And I am almost level 51 as well. I think this kill uh, Dale areas after Mor Mordor. Makes sense then, because I didn't even get through Mordor. Alright. Dead. Push! <laughs> Oh! Come here, Scout. Come here. Come here. Come on. Come on. I don't want to activate the gun right now. What am I dragging you around? Dragging you around a horse. Okay. Uh, coffee! Going shot for shot for this guy. Alright. Arm the trap and lure him into it. So let's arm the dwarf made deadfall. Uh, another another guy who has not had his coffee in the morning. Come here, Pucklore. Come on, friend. Come on. It killed him, but not his trusty guard. I will avenge you, my goblin king. <laughs> uh, be there at about uh, level 118, maybe 120, depending on how long you stay in order. Yeah. Yeah, like I said, really when the host got to uh, approach the Black Eight, that's kind of when I stopped playing my main character and started this one. And return to Selig through the tiny hole. I can I can I can fit in that tiny hole. Hello, Selig. Deadfall is the Arcs done. of Moria have much to account for. Okay, so I have to go back to the deep descent. Well, I gotta talk to that guy that I think is like right over here, or he's up there. I don't know. This place has nine different layers. All right, that looks like somebody I need to talk to. All right, that's Flick. All right, so I gotta talk to you. Hi, Flick. Can I not get next to the edge because I have her to go? Thanks. Valin came, but we have heard no word from him. Oh, we can okay. only hope that Durin's bane sleeps deeply. Uh, inform him that we're ready to go? Um, Dark things dwell now in Moria. Ready to go. <laughs> um, I... I'm happy to be here, but yeah, I, I'm not a, the biggest fan of it. Um, heights give me a problem. <laughs> But also trying to find things in this place is uh, a pain in the butt sometimes. Most times. All times. Let's just, let's just go with that. It's all times this place is pain in the ass. My uh, Vela is leveling up though. She's up to level 14. I know you cannot see it because I can't move where it is on my uh, display right now. Don't pick on him. He wasn't even going to do anything to you. Every time. <laughs> These guys always just go after, like, just docile creatures. Uh, Moria, like, uh, I like all the copies of stuff. Oh, Mordor. Mordor, 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 Mordor. Gotcha. I don't know why, but I look at Mordor and Moria and I see the same damn thing. I'm a, I'm a big dummy. Uh, yeah, and I mean, it's gonna be fun exploring it for the first time, I guess. Um, when we get to that point. Get back up here. Thank you. So it's gonna be something new. You're gonna you're gonna have to be my guide there, uh, Vela. But I think we have a long way to go before we reach uh reach Mordor. A long way to go. We still have to survive the uh the attack on um Gondor. That's, <laughs> I'm blanking on names right now. Yes, everyone, we actually do get to fight in the battle for Gondor and at Helm's Deep in Rohan. So that's going to be fun. That's going to be a lot of fun. When we eventually get there, legendary item is leveled up. Um, we don't spin level up. Helnor Fields? Mm-hmm. 
all kinds of fun things coming in the future, everyone. So uh, you're going to want to make sure that you are uh, following the channel and watching every Monday as we make our way there. You know, just saying. Uh, all, all right, let's get back down here to him. Yeah. Right now, you're technically uh, on like a pair. You're behind the uh, the fellowship, so they've already been through here. That's why you see it like uh, the the clips in between chapters, and you're kind of doing cleanup, trying to keep a uh, Sauron off your back. Yeah, you're trying to keep a uh, trying to keep him safe. The Lords of Moria have returned. Following up. That's that's my taking of it at least. Uh, fall, of course, fall. Hmm. Those aren't bad. I'm going to take them and hang on to them. I'm going to take them. I'm just going to unfollow to follow again. <laughs> I'm I appreciate sure it. can be restored. Uh, the orcs have crappy. surely ruined it. You talk a lot, Steer. Like, a lot. I'm not sure Casa Doom can be restored. There we the go. orcs have surely ruined it. Yeah, you actually uh, meet up with Frodo at a certain point, too. So, lots of cool things. Uh, Burgers and Hunters... Yeah, this game is really, really steeped in lore, so you get to learn a lot. Hear me out, friend, for I have a tale of glory to tell. Talk to Thalner and his mining camp. All right. Uh, Moria. And where's my book? There it is. So I need to go to Bozy. You have a quest, too. Hello. If we are to find nope, Mithril nope, in Casa Doom, I'm we good. will first have to deal with the orcs. <laughs> I'm good with a, without doing a red quest. That's fine. Uh, do you have the option to slap Frodo in the face? That would be great. You know what? That would be great sometimes. Frodo is an infuriating character sometimes. Uh, Durin's way. Ah, the Chamber of the Crossroads. There it is. So it's back through Golden View to Durin's way. Uh to the Chamber of the Crossroads is where I need to go. But first, I need to talk to Felthfear at his mining camp. Which is... that way? There he is. Um, by the way, this map is useless. <laughs> Just so you know, uh, when you come to Moria, the map is actually useless. <laughs> Alright. So, let's try and find our way to him. And uh, also, you'll notice something right here. All my horses are grayed out. Uh, the only mounts that are allowed in here are goats. And I have absolutely no problem with that, because I love goats. There's mounted combat later also. Indeed. Something I've always hated. I've never been good at mounted combat. Why use the map? Uh, to get a general idea of where things are. But the problem with Moria is everything's up and down. See how far that goes down? You're like, the guy's in generally that area? That's all I know, is that he's somewhere over there. <laughs> so you just kind of do your best with what you got. So let's just kind of make the way down here. For being in a damp cave, uh, these, these wooden structures have held up surprisingly well. Um, it's still this way. Ah, I think I actually got him fairly quick. So that's something as least. Well, I heard a goat. I hear bleedings of goats. Aha! Aha! There we go. Uh, the light war seat is best, I think. They turn better, yeah. Uh, that was always the thing. Um, the turn radius on those things are murderous. But then again, I was my hunter, so really, I never had to get close to anything. So I would just, I would, I would just uh, kite. That's pretty much all I would do. The problem is with damage output. I just couldn't match with the damage. Valin came, but we have heard no word from him. And we can only hope that Durian's bane well. sleeps deeply. Oh. If we drive the orcs from Casa Doom, will it be enough? Uh, somebody else that looks like has quests here, and it is you. 
Abide here a moment and speak with me. Scout dead end passages and scout the intact passages. That'll be fun. All right. Um, got tons of stuff in my inventory. Let's use all of this reputation. All the wrap M items in the world. That beautiful. All right. So the first thing I need to do is go uh, that direction ish. <laughs> So we'll follow the tracks here. Reputation uh, gives you uh, better prices when you trade stuff, and you can actually have access to better items. Uh, so like the Mathem Society, I'm an ally to. If I got Kindred, I'd have access to their items that they sell at their specific uh, like society house. And like it's uh, trying to think of it, trying to think of like the best way to describe it. Uh, it's faction armor, I guess, if you played uh, any kind of like MMOs, kind of things like that. It's like charisma. Yeah, you're friends with them to the point where they'll give you good prices and good things for, well, for a price. <laughs> uh, do I have to kill these? I don't think I do. Uh, where am I going? All right, intact, but no, uh, not, no, a sense of dread. All right, dread I can deal with. All kinds of little bugs and stuff here. Examine that. That is a dead end. Okay. And looks like everything there. Turn. What? What? Oh, it's a rare. Hello, doll. Let's get away from a. Uh, that guy. A little bit there. Oh, he's kicking my ass. Um, I should probably take him seriously. Uh, he has a lot. Of, uh, not not too much hit. He has 16 thousand. It's not too bad. Would you face me and not like look away? Uh, but he is hitting me pretty hard. I know. Come on, Vela. We need to we need to own this battle. A lot of heals. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Ow! Revive for free! Hurry before he heals! Ow, he healed! <laughs> uh, and I don't... I My heal potion's even on, uh, and I don't have a lot of hit points right now. Um, I was not expecting that. That is a rip. And if I was Raven, I'd say, can I get some rips in chat? So, let's, uh... Kind of skirt around him. That's a worm. That's that's him again! No! I'm not ready! <laughs> I, I'm so not ready for this! <laughs> Run! They, oh, I'm being attacked by a worm! Leave me alone! <laughs> Dwarves, help me! Help me, dwarves! Okay, never mind. I, I wasn't running. I was uh, exercising my legs, alright? Thank you. Uh, <laughs> alright, so there's a passage that looks like over there I gotta go to. Which means probably take uh, the tracks down this way. Uh, that is a bug I don't have to worry about. That is a goblin I can kill, though. It, yeah, it's it's a brisk walk. Exactly, guy. Exactly. It is a brisk, brisk walk. Uh, beautiful. <laughs> Vela, I deserve that. Absolutely deserve that. I have I I, I deserve the derps. Uh, where is where are you telling me to go, game? This is why Moria is, uh, sometimes very frustrating. Like, I gotta get over to those gears, eventually, somehow. Will you stop that? I was about to hit you with a big attack. Thank you. That was my derp, Vela. My derp. I own it. I gotta level you up. I need you to do more damage. Uh, legendary. I can't, uh, I just can't get you new. Some more uh, DPS. I don't want to open up the Lotus source so you can see my my email address. No. 
Even though probably everyone's already seen it already in my pants. And... And... Even with the level up, I'm still not where I need to be. Alright, there's another... Can I reach you from here? Are you telling me I can't reach that hook? Yeah, I'm gonna kill him. I'm gonna have to kill you. He's probably still picking up, uh... He's probably still picking up, guy. Uh, when Raven streams, he throws stuff all over the place. He's... He's, he's a madman! <laughs> no. <laughs> No, he's a he's a good dude. He's not mad. He's just born that way. And oh, I apparently have to kill creatures here too. So it's a good thing I actually decided to do that. It's not that I'm I'm under bloodlust or anything. I I don't enjoy killing these people, right? Yeah, that's it. I don't enjoy the murder of goblins, but I do what I must do. Uh, burglar is the best class. It absolutely is. 110%. As as I've been playing uh, playing this character, it's, it really makes me miss my hunter. Because um, she she just cakewalks through uh, through more through places like this. Because she was just a DPS machine. Uh, burglars can uh, sneak. Uh, they really can just avoid most of the things in Moria. And they can backstab them. Uh, you have to make it a hobbit, just cause. Yeah, absolutely. There's no other class it could be. Repair the wheel. I don't know why I'm repairing all these wheels. Uh, the goblins kind of own them, so... It makes sense. It does. Hello. Ah, little thief. Stop hitting me like that. Seven out of twelve on enemies. Beautiful. Five of eight on gears. Six and seven and eight are right there. Let's wait for that guard to get some distance. I don't want to get all three of them at once. They're still yellow, so they can still hit me with some pretty good damage. I own this stuff. Uh, Stealth and Mez, if you're uh, in red line, you can really one-shot me again. Would you start moving? Thank you. Now, come here. <laughs> He's just bristling with arrows. <laughs> oh... I still... Burglar's one class I really haven't played much. Um, mostly because my friend, when we started playing the game, uh, already had a Burglar, and it was his name. So... I didn't want to be, like, just two Burglars running around, even though we would have owned everything. Come here. Can you get Mithril? I believe you can get Mithril in this game. But not, like, THE Mithril. Huh? I don't know, to be honest with you. I can't even remember. I don't know if Mithril's mindable or not. I never really did uh, the crafting stuff, so I don't even know if uh, it gets up to, to Mithril. Another another thing I haven't done in this game. What the <laughs> There we go. All the gears are repaired. I still need to kill two more enemies. But I think I can get them on the way. Yeah, there's... Like, bugs and stuff all over here. So I'm not too worried about that. Very bug. That is one large arrow I shot in you! Holy shit! <laughs> uh, but not Frodo's armor yet. He needs that armor. Uh, does that count? 11 and 12. It did count. I need one more creature to kill. And Deep Claw Masher, I choose you. <laughs> You're right, though. Frodo should give that armor to Sam. Sam's the hero of the story. Actually, he was intended to be the hero of the story. Uh, 
from what uh, at least I believe that's what Tolkien said. That Sam was actually the intended uh Where am I still need to go? There should be dead ends I have to uh explore, which I think is like right over there. So let's just run back up, that's prepared. Rudy I love the movie Rudy. Uh let's talk about that. Uh, the lore master did really well. Yeah. Really, anything with like pets can will do pretty pretty well here. Your goblins say like weird things like meow. I don't know why the goblins are meowing, but they are. <laughs> Should get a uh, Vela and Ant team up on the stream. Play some Lotro. I am not sure Khazadum can be restored. Uh, the orcs have surely offerings. ruined it. Might based medium armor. Yeah, I'm good about that. Light armor. I'll just steal your two handed hammer. Thank you. If it were not for the prospect of finding Mithril, I would not have come here. But finding Mithril? You? I will take that. I will take that. I will take that. I will take that. I will take those. And I will take the uh, skin, I guess. Yeah, the goblins were meowing, guy. I'm not exactly sure why. Many foutings dwell in the depths of the mountains. I fear the orcs will be the least of our troubles. Light lamps along the winding path. I'm guessing that was the same path I was just walking down. Yep. All right. All right. All right. All of this is good experience. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna badmouth that this is all really good experience to get. Uh, because right now we are still a bit out of our uh, level range. Because they're still yellow. Like, the quests are, are fine. I mean, I'm, I'm still cutting through the monsters pretty quick. But as you saw with that rare guy, I was getting wrecked. Absolutely wrecked. Three of nine. Where's the next? <laughs> you hear that? Am I the only one? <laughs> uh, the XP is right here. Right on the bottom. Right on the bottom of the screen. It's that yellow bar that's, uh, where it has my level number here. So, light the torch. There go. Yep, I knew I was going to get that aggro. I knew it. I knew it. My weapon uh, experience is actually right behind my head, unfortunately. Um, and I always forget the command that will... Uh, That'll unlock my UI so I can move it. I always forget it, so I always have to look it up. But I'll do that before my next stream, so I can move it. Swing and a miss, Vela. There. Vela, will you connect? Thank you. Excellent. She needs some levels. She needs levels, but she's fine. She's level 16. Light the lamp. Light the lamp. See the big door to the way of the smiths. Big fancy door. Uh, control. Well, let's see if I can do that right now. Let's do it while I'm not facing the giant chasm. Uh, not that. Um. Nope. Wasn't working. Ah, there we go. Now it did. The advancement track. Let's. Like right there. Beautiful. Now you can actually see it. Thank you, Vela. That actually did work. I was the dumb one. Thank you. What sorcery is this? Yeah, the UI is fully customizable. Um, so you can move things anywhere you want. You can blow it up, bigger, things like that, so. All the cool classic things from MMOs, and this thing is just down and down and down. <laughs> I don't like this path. I'm gonna go back upstairs. <laughs> uh, I don't dare fall because I don't know where it will put me uh, when it reses me. <laughs> I mean, I, I, I guess I could, for the uh, enjoyment of the stream, jump off uh, into the endless chasm. 
but I, I please don't make me. Please don't. Uh, there is a dungeon at the bottom. Indeed. Just a big pit. I think I've done that once. I think I've done that one time. Back up we go. Do, 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 do. The immensity of this place is so evident in everything you see. You know, just from... Look at that. Look at the places we haven't been up there. <laughs> this place is crazy huge. And I love it. I love every little bit. Everything's all dark and creepy. But then again, uh, probably four streams into here, I'm going to be like, I'm ready to leave now. <laughs> I'm ready to go to Lothlorien. Please, please let me go. I need sunlight. <laughs> it is said that Durin's Bane dwells here, though we have not seen it. <laughs> well, okay then. If Durin's Bane lives still, we will destroy it and make of it a standard to terrify our foes. Uh, your helmet looks like Magneto's. <laughs> Uh, I can see it a little bit. I can see that a little. Uh, Gathworks Foe. 70 damage. 69. 69. Let's get rid of that. Flix Nicholas. Um. Yeah, when Moria first came out, um. It was definitely. I don't want that anymore. And. I guess I don't need you anymore. As I'm leveling up Vela. Uh, I look confused. <laughs> I look very, very confused about what's going on and why I'm here. <laughs> Alright, so we gotta scout those passages still. So let's get back to work. Uh, it's telling me to go this way, actually. So I guess it's counting that as a dead end passage up there. And level item up. By the way, coffee today is again the Dunkin Espresso Roast. I needed the energy. I was so lazy today that I made myself tired. <laughs> we, uh, Lady Ant and I went to, uh, one of the local malls and, uh, Went to one of the only arcades left and uh, spent some time there. And it was fun. It was really, really fun. I don't know what I'm hearing. <laughs> Alright, so I gotta go this way. The Raven has returned. The Raven has returned. Welcome back, Raven. I hope your tea is absolutely fantastic and all you dreamed of in life. I would like not to attack the diseased dragon net. Uh, that's a bug. Don't care about bugs. Don't. Uh, there's a worm somewhere here, isn't there? Nope. It's on the other side. Don't have to worry about the worms. <laughs> Praise Ant. I'm not a deity. Or am I? End up taking a shower and mixing tea. Um, probably shouldn't make tea in the shower, but then again, I'm no scientist. So. You know what? You do you, brother. <laughs> So what, you heated the water in the shower, like covered yourself in tea bags and just kind of filled a cup? <laughs> That's how I would make tea. <laughs> Where else would he get the water? Exactly! Exactly! This bat's kicking my ass. Please die, because he's diseased. And the stupid worm, you were on the goblin side last time. You chose poorly, Deep's Glowworm. I had a Glowworm when I was a kid, and you were nothing like it. Uh, never say cover yourself in tea bags again. <laughs> yeah, let's not quote that one. Let's leave that. Let's, uh, let innuendos, sleeping innuendos lie, right? Uh, am I going to run into that dude again? Please don't let me run into that dude again. Please don't let me run into that dude again. And put up signposts. <laughs> Sell my own raven cheek fresh from the tub. <laughs> it sounds like you're a moonshiner. 
Um, right, signpost here. And I think we're finally done with this area. And we can make our way to Bozy over at the Chamber of the Crossroads in Dune Bay. I have to return to Guffy. All these guys have, like, names of gummy bears, I swear to God. The time has come to drive forth the orcs from our kingdom. Oh, now he wants more. We have seen naught of Dune Bay. Travel to Bay. the... Alright, you know Beware what? if you journey into Moria. This is a solo quest? Okay, well, let's do it! Mithra, it is called by the elves, and true silver in the common tongue. But the dwarves do not share their own secret name. The uh, hope of finding it has led on. many dwarves to their doom in, in Moria. For they seldom heed the dire warnings when their hearts yearn for Mithril, cold and bright in the dark. So as I make myself another cup of tea, I want to welcome everyone in here for Lotro Mondays. Uh, we're about an hour and a little under an hour and a half in. So I want to thank everyone who's out there. Uh, I'm Antagonist to 2000, by the way, if you couldn't tell from, uh, you know, watching the channel. And, uh, yeah, I hope you're actually, I uh, hope you're having a great night tonight, this Monday. For those of you returning back to work tomorrow, like myself, Godspeed. <laughs> Dog speed to you. Making myself finish up a cup of coffee here. And we are here in Moria. Which is, uh, an oh-so-fun place, uh, where... <laughs> Where the maps are worthless and the uh, and the locations mean nothing. So uh, a little self promotion here as well. I am a variety streamer. I stream six days a week, with one, uh, Wednesday being my day off. Uh, I only have a few set games I play on set days. I play uh, Surviving Mars every Saturday. I play Stellaris every Sunday, and Monday is Lord of the Rings Online, as you can see here. So hello! Oh my goodness. The giant praying mantis thing. Can you can you die? I don't like you. You're icky. <laughs> and you interrupt you interrupted my self promotion. <laughs> I s <laughs> okay. So I stream at 6 p.m. Eastern time. Uh, when I do stream, uh, those six days. Uh, so if you like what you see here, uh, you know, and you want to catch more, definitely give the channel a follow. Definitely looking for more fun. Oops. Do I wait for the goblins? No. Let's get the high defender. And if you really like what you see here, uh, feel free to drop us up. Remember, none of that is actually uh, required to watch. I just hope you have a great time. That is all I care about. Uh, let's see. I really like the look of this zone. I don't know why I love dungeon. You know what? This, this whole place is just great. Everything is... While it's huge, it's claustrophobic as hell. Because... <laughs> You enter these really tight passages, uh, but then again, you're in these huge, beautiful caverns at the same time, but you're not seeing the sky, ever. <laughs> in the SM. I like the tight passages. Hey, you know what? You know what, guy? To each their own, man. Each their own. As long as it's not hurting someone else in a non-consensual way, it's cool. If the hurting's consensual, then have fun. <laughs> uh, what did what did uh, Todd from uh, uh, Scrub say? Um, if if it's uh, if it doesn't hurt, you're not doing it right. <laughs> when uh, Elliot said that. Uh, he cried during sex. <laughs> if it doesn't hurt, you're not doing it right. Uh, the same can be said for gaming, I guess. Words I live by. <laughs> Absolutely. Absolutely. I don't like these things at all. I don't, I don't like the big pincery, mouth grabby things. I can just go away. <laughs> Grab that. And hopefully after this, this will be it and we can head our way to, uh, over to Bozy. Forward? I don't have any quarrel. I'm probably going to have to fight you, aren't I? Nope, I don't want to fight you, I don't want to fight you, I don't want to fight you. Thank you. I'll just leave you alone as you should be. Giant set. Yeah, they're, they're like centipedes and praying mantises, like, had babies. 
Uh, whatever Balan accomplished here, the site is no longer safe for miners. And then again, I think of uh, Galaxy Quest. Well, of course they're miners. They gotta be, like, five or six. They're miners, not miners. I don't get it. <laughs> Great movie, by the way. Great movie. Tim Allen movie. The time go. has come to drive forth the Oryx from our kingdom. And that is done, and I believe, besides that one... Oh, what do you want to I doubt to that Lord Balian still lives. Yeah, I will seek him out as I head southwards. But I don't want to head southwards just yet. We need to go back to... I need to go back to the Deep Descent, hop on the horse, get moving towards uh, Doldenview. Doldenview to Durn's Way, and Durn's Way to the Chamber of Secrets. Or the, ch the Chamber of Crossroads. Chamber of Secrets is something completely different. Oh my. So let's get a move on it. And hopefully, I gotta get enough reputation up where I can get a, uh, get a ran in here. Because traveling by foot is lame. So let's turn that off for now. And let's go to Posey. I don't want to use a Mithril coin. Uh, because that is cheating. I've already cheated enough on this stream. So we're not going to be doing that again. So let's get up and over. So pretty. All the purple crystals you can't mine. I'd be rich! <laughs> and I believe it's just... Nope, it's that way. Yep. Uh, we'll speed this up as fast as I can. I have a little sprint ability. It's nothing much, and it goes away really quick, though. I love this place. I love it so much. So, we will hop the horse on up. Maybe he can take me right to the chamber. These halls will be great once more. No, he cannot. So let's go to Goldenview. And make our way over to Bossy. Or Bossy, I think his name might be. I love these goats. They have little lamps on them. And if you take a look, there's mining gear inside of his backpack. Almost see it. That's a big no. I don't like that. <laughs> There's uh, one of the stat buried statues from Fallout right there. Yeah. Alright, now you, can you connect The time me? has come to drive forth the orcs from our kingdom. Uh, no, I'm just about... Hey, do it, man. I, I wholeheartedly uh, promote anyone that wants to watch uh, Lord of the Rings. Uh, do I do the run... May do I... return soon nope, to his it's, it's cheating. I can't. I will not use the Mithril coin. We are running. I'm going to regret this. We're running to uh, Durin's Way. Or uh, the Chamber of uh, Crossroads. Look at this. Thank you, music. You're putting a good emphasis on it. Oh, man. Yes, I did see that. I didn't get uh, much details, but I did see it. That sounds actually pretty cool. I'd like to see what he was doing with the Rangers uh, for all those years. That'll be really, really cool. Oh, shut up. <laughs> then you must... Gala, you must go look it up right now. Quit watching this fool of an antagonizer and go, go check it out. <laughs> there we go. Beautiful. Now, there's a big dwarf statue there. Do I go up and around? Is there a way over here? I don't know. <laughs> uh, I don't think there's a way over here. No, there is no way over there. Um, okay, so, 
Moria is a maze. And they call it a mine. A mine! <laughs> ah! <laughs> Scared the shit out of myself. Where's the stairs? Oh. So was this just like a dead end and I can't go anywhere? Yep, this was just a big old dead end. Excellent. Alright. So, back this way. See, I told you I'm going to regret doing this, uh... Doing the run myself. That, that's not a staircase either. <laughs> Jump, tuck, and roll. It's absolutely fine. 100% safety. Okay, so is that... That's a stairway. There we go. Uh, first episode starts next year. Fantastic. Fantastic. I can't wait. It'll be fun. It'll be lots of fun. Okay, so I want to go this way. That's all goblins down there. I discovered Gatsner. So I kind of need to get, like, over there. So, uh, down, over. It's like a puzzle maze here. Busted up library. The Chamber of Knowledge. Something tells me I might have to come back here later. <laughs> Fair enough. Alright. Oh, this place is so immense. The music in here is epic as well. I love it. I almost want to, like, just not talk. Because, uh... Look at this. Look at it. Take it in. Uh, Subnautica is tomorrow. God, this game's aged. I love it. I, I love it. I... That is a lot of beard. It is. <laughs> it is a lot of beard. I discovered the dwarf lord's gate. For such a tiny people, they made such big holes. Uh, all right, so we're finally running into things that uh, will attack us. Uh, it better be good though. Uh, Subnautica or the Lord of the Rings. <laughs> I'm hoping Subnautica's good. Oop. I'd make sure there were stairs. I had to make sure there were stairs. I think we're almost to the Chamber of the Crossroads. Which, yeah, looks like, yeah, this is the right way. When you start seeing dwarves, you're starting to head in the right way. Uh, that is an Elder Moria rider. I'm not sure about him just yet. Uh, you... We have little time to speak. Great Examine events have been set in motion. Statue. Um... The statue. That statue? This right here? Take a pot shot at you. Come here, boy! Um... This is anticlimactic. I thought it was going to be on a war dog and going to run at me and spear me or something. There we go. We finally ran out of arrows. <laughs> All right. All right, we can do that. Big stab, stab. Uh, all right, I have examined the statue. Missing most of its body from the waist up. He was toe up from the flow up. These holes will be great once more. All right. I'm glad I was able to get free experience from that. <laughs> Don't know why he wanted it, but I, I got the experience. That's cool. The Let's time has that. come to drive forth the orcs from our kingdom. Beautiful. And Bori, where are you? Or Bosi. Where are you, Bosi? There you are. I have need of your great skill. I do have great skill. 
We must be cautious. Dwarves have not uh, but Amazon's got the money years. and we're making Oh, they're making an MMO of it as well? Or just an MMO of something different. I will defeat red thing red blog red blogs, rubber rebbings. We can only hope that Durin's Bane sleeps deeply. I hate these quests. I don't want to do them. <laughs> I do not want to help you and all your stupid friends, alright? Hey. Hello, Anger Management. She's AFK, but I'm still cheer at her. Because, uh, she's Clarabelle, the bearer of hope. Hurrah! Hurrah! Uh, just an MMO. Okay. Is there any details on it? Uh, what they're gonna be doing? That is a door I don't need to go in. So let's rebind ourselves um, here for now. We can always go back to uh, Dolvin Beal if we have to. And the other quest, there's no quest up there. And. Okay, so you wanted to. Within the Great Delving. Wait, but wouldn't that be back where I was? Yeah, that's back where I was. Um, there is a new uh, Lord, of, Lord of the Rings uh, MMO being made, though. That is kind of hype. Uh, Raven, can you throw me a hype? Can you throw me a Raven hype in chat? Because I think it's needed. There we go. That's the Raven hype. So I guess I gotta kill bugs. I gotta go bug smushing. Uh, Alright, so I'm in the Great Delving now. Yeah, yourself. <laughs> and it's orange. Now, the good thing is these things die pretty easily. So I'm not too worried about fighting these guys. The new MMO will take place in the years leading up to the events of Lord of the Rings. Ah, okay. Gotcha. Okay, that's actually that sounds kind of cool. That sounds like a cool premise. Now, do you mean before the events of uh, Lord of the Rings uh, and not The Hobbit? Just, I'm just checking, uh, because, you know, the time frames are staggered there. Because sometimes when people talk about Lord of the Rings, they don't include The Hobbit. But some, sometimes they do. It's, it, uh, I guess it depends on whoever you talk to. Um, I don't want to fall. I don't want to fall. Can I cross your big beard? Goblin builder. Um, let's not go this way. This way is a silly way to go. I don't want to fall in the endless pit of despair. Uh, it'll be after Bilbo's adventures. Okay. Alright. Fair enough. Fair enough. I just, I'm still going to play it. <laughs> I'll still play it when it comes out. Is that a bug? Uh, that is an ornate treasure. Hello. Uh, talk to Randy. I can talk to Randy. New Worlds is the name of Amazon's MMO. Oh, cool. I will be checking that out after the stream today, then. So, let's go back. So, let's be sandbox it. Cool. Good. I like to be able to kind of do what you want. Let's kill these bugs. I gotta find bugs. Like that one! Hello! Come to me, bug. Arrows do nothing to him. Although he... <laughs> I love the size comparison, because he's a tiny enemy. The arrows blow up the... Just gigantic, like I'm shooting with a crossbow. <laughs> Oh my. And I gotta kill, what, 12 of these things? Ugh. So many bugs, so little time. Uh, they hired X Arena Net employees to work on it. Oh! Okay. I'm guessing there's not any details on the uh, Amazon MMO, like too much out there yet. 
Uh, do we have more bugs up? Like, there's so many rooms here. I just want to... Uh, I want to go into and you can't. Uh, no bugs down here. Just a giant gaping hole I don't want to look down. Alright. <laughs> Vela, you're killing me! Uh, there's some news. Cool. Feel free to, uh, spread the news, so to speak. These are all... These are all just deep claws. Yeah, these are all just deep claws. Yep, this is a deep claw nest. I'm going to, uh, step on out. And what is that? Riddles in the library. Let's worry about that later. Yeah, yourself. Uh, the arena employees they hired are the ones that worked on Guild War One. Okay. So they got good employees. Cool names. Cool names. If I was a series of tiny bugs, where would I be? I mean, I know I'm an ant and everything, but. Ah, there's one. Hello, friend. That's a hole. <laughs> there's a dwarf over there for some reason. Uh, they got good employees. I wish I had good employees. I should say, I, got, I have great employees. Uh, let's see, those are soldiers. Uh... Kestis, hey, how you doing, friend? Uh, by the way, it's not Amazon who's making the MMO. Amazon is the TV series. A really fun company called Athlon Games is going to make the MMO. Published by the guys who have Warframe as well. Oh. Okay. Very interesting. Either way, um, Amazon, Athlon, uh, and Spearon. <laughs> uh, pretty much, I get, uh, pretty much, no matter who makes it, I'm probably going to play it. <laughs> when it comes out. So, e whatever way it goes, I will definitely be giving it a try. I mean, you could you could tell me that uh, Toys R Us is making it right now, and I'd probably believe you, because I have, I have no information on it. I'm relying on you all, you all for my information. Uh, there's nothing there. Where are these stupid bugs? Come to me, tiny bugs. You're... I don't... No, I don't want to talk to you right now. I think I've killed all the bugs in this area. Um, alright. Let's go back to uh, the crossroads. Let's head back there. And then we'll work on... Uh, this overseer. Probably kick my ass. Let's see what else. And that's a book quest, too. Son of a biscuit. That is a book quest. Yeah, I'll have to look and see what's going on. Uh, is that another bug? Ah. These bugs actually spawn in fairly quick. Excellent. Good, because I'm only halfway done with this quest. I want to finish this quest, and then we can probably call it a night. Because I think uh, getting into Moria and... Uh, getting pretty deep into it. Getting into the crossroads. Because next stream, I would love to get to... Um, the 21st Hall. That's a that's a pretty big, awesome place to see if you've never seen it. Uh, that's just, it's, the, the epic size of Moria just astounds me. Every time I think about it. And... Beautiful. 8 to 12. Any bugs down there? Nope. Just like last time, still no bugs. Should be some in the hallway, though. Which was... Yep, right across here. So thank you, uh, Vela and Kesas, for the uh, for the update on the news. Thank you very, very much. I mean, hearing that any MMO is coming out is always... I, I, I'm always glad, because the, uh, the MMO age is kind of on the down... It's on the downside. I mean, it's not even kind of. It's, it's absolutely on the downswing. So hearing that somebody's actually putting some time on it, uh, some time into an MMO, is always great news. Uh, so I kind of got to stay in this area. 
Uh, I want to get back to war next Sunday. The anticipation is killing me. Yes, uh, we are going to be going to war in Stellaris next Sunday. And that's going to be very, very fun. Think of this as a cal uh, palate cleanser, uh, guy. I mean, you could. I mean, I'm still killing. Vale is doing a great job at uh, murdering things to death here. So, I mean, you're get you're getting your blood in one way or another, guy. One way or another, you're getting it. <laughs> Uh, that's a default. Is that a bug? That is a bug. Can I pull you over here, please? Can you come? Can you make your way here? Can you do that? Come on. Come on, little bug. That is so close to the... to the drop. What if I come over here? Will you come here? Ah, there we go. Don't, don't worry though, guy. Stellaris ain't going nowhere. That, that war is not going to start without you. And that's 11 of 12, and I need one more stupid little bug. And there he is. You are my lucky contestant. Oh, uh, okay, so the two different ones. Gotcha. There was a little disconnect. Gotcha, understood. I'm excited for both of them, though. Catalyst is hard as he souls tonight. Ah, Amazon's doing the TV series, another company's doing the uh, MMO, and then Amazon is actually doing their own MMO. I like how, I like how it somehow autocorrect took uh, Vela and made a Catalyst. Because you know what? Vela is a Catalyst. A Catalyst for fun. That's what she is. Alright, so let's go turn in our book quest to Bozy and see where he's going to point us next. The chamber at the crossroads is just to the east of the stone circle. His job is to literally just stand here and wait for somebody to walk by. <laughs> oh. Yeah, Amazon's doing the New World MMO. It, again, I'm going to take a look. I'm going to see if, uh, what information's out there if there's any... Uh, uh, gameplay footage in some way, shape, or form. That'd be interesting to see. Um, New World sounds definitely sci-fi-ish in a way, so that would be interesting. It'd be good to actually see another good uh, space MMO. You have done well, friend. Thank you. Records and histories of Moria will only close data if you and can find MDM. them. Oh, it's fantasy. Fair enough. All right, find and search the chamber of knowledge, the smell, uh, chamber of wisdom, and the chamber of deep thought. <laughs> I know where the deep thought is, and I think I know where the knowledge one is. I think we actually uh, walked into there. Don't ask me how I know that. <gasps> Raven breaking the law. Uh, Raven is also known as Hacker Man. If you've ever seen the the meme, he is the hacker man. Um, what's that show with hackers? I can't remember. The name. House of Dooley will live forever. Tough hear me out, friend, for I have a tale of glory to tell. Well, I don't want to hear your tale of glory. Uh, I gotta talk to someone here, though. Hello. Dwarves must fight for dwarves. And go talk to Rambi again. <laughs> Greetings, friend. Are you lost? Uh, doesn't think it was done by the bats, neither do I. The bats fit in somehow. Haven't figured it out. Beautiful. And Vela has leveled up again. Let's see if I can throw some more points on her. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. 104 damage. That's tasty. That is a tasty, tasty sword. Vela's got her glow on. We're doing great. Alright. So, I think right here, uh, before... I mean, technically, I could take the Lover's Leap down the well here, uh, because you can't. And it leads to the Wetworks uh, area of the map, which is, uh, if I show you, there were the Wetworks. Ah, down here. As you can see, you can drop down the well, and you'll end up in here. <laughs> uh, or you'll die. One of the two things happen, because you can actually hit a rock and die. 
Uh, it comes down to chance if you live. <laughs> so, uh, we might do that next... Am I bound here? Hold on. I want to leave you guys on a really, really uh, fun note here. So, let's find that binding stone. If I was a binding stone, where would I be? Uh, Chamber of the Crossroads, we're already bound here. All right. This is how we're ending, everyone. Geronimo! Ah! Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna hit the light! <laughs> oh, but I got to the city of the Wentworks! Uh, I think it's right up here. Let me grab the horse that's here. <laughs> oh, man. See, I had to leave you guys on something, and that's... And my death is what I'm going to leave you guys on. So the House get of that. Durin will live forever. <laughs> uh, did you see what Jagex Twitch banned a streamer because he was more potential to kill himself? I didn't see that. I just uh, jumped on a well. <laughs> uh, but yeah, uh, if anyone... Uh, yeah, that's, that's, that's a shitty thing for them to do anyway. Uh, if you do that. I would not do that. Uh, so if anyone took that as me uh, promoting it, do not, please, because that was just me uh, getting to a new area, technically. The waterworks. And here I am. In the waterworks. The suicide is not a laughing matter. But anyway, uh, at this point, I think this is... Well, now it's a depressing note to end on. But uh, it is really messed up. It is very messed up for somebody to do that. Uh, so yeah, that's where the well came out of, and I'm guessing the well uh, actually went all the way down at one point, right to the bottom. We kind of just like snacked ourselves on the uh, end of the well. I think that's a pretty... No, that's a big face. Never mind. That was a big face. Yeah, I'm not exactly sure where it drops from. Silverload, uh, Delving, Durin. Because you're... Dr I wish there was a way to actually see level uh, layer, a layer map there. But anyway, this is where we will end. I will do a little jig for you here. <laughs> that dwarf's like, I will have none of this dance. <laughs> Let's see if I can find someone for us to raid. I want to thank everyone out there uh, while I am finding uh, somebody to uh, to hit up here. Uh, you are all absolutely amazing. I really do appreciate uh, all the love that you've always given. And uh, we have made it to Moria. So we have completed our first goal. Now we have to get through Moria, which means doing all of the book quests. And we're going to. We are absolutely going to. Uh, da, 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 da. uh looks like Mike is doing Monster World Hunter, but H.A. Tenchi is doing No More Heroes. Ooh, that's a tough one. That's a tough one, and we're going to have to go back to the old uh, sugar flip. Uh, it's going to be Zing side up for uh, Tenchi. And, uh, war government warnings <laughs> for Mike. Let's flip it. It is Tenchi. So, we're going to be going to HG Tenchi, uh, HJ Tenchi, I'm sorry, playing No More Heroes. So, I hope everyone had an absolutely fantastic night. Please hang around for the raid. Uh, very great streamer, so I, you will have a fantastic time. I gotta spell his name right. Uh, that'd probably be the first thing to do. There we go. All right, everyone. Again, you've all been absolutely amazing. I've been Antagonizer. We'll be back with Subnautica tomorrow. Everyone have an absolutely fantastic night. Peace out. Time you had a new katana.